guys, welcome. My name is Shay from DreamHomeBaseWork.com. I am really excited to be back here on camera for this video. Um, a lot of my past videos have um, been, you know, some screen records. So I want to welcome everyone back. I want to welcome my new subscribers as well as those that have been tuned in for a while now. If you are completely new, you would want to make sure that you subscribe, of course, to this channel. Also. I have a newsletter that I send out by email uh, for any blog updates that I have um, as far as job leads, extra income ideas, and so much more. So you will want to make sure that you subscribe to my newsletter, my blog newsletter, and I send that out every week, um, at least once or twice per week with different job alerts and different um, work at home ideas that can help you guys earn some extra money. So today's video is going to be about part-time jobs and this is a very popular topic especially for those that may not want to uh, work a full eight-hour shift. Um, sometimes I know you guys may have um, other obligations like you may be in school, you may even want to keep a second job you know or you may be a stay-at-home mom that is looking for the flexibility um, to work around your schedule so I am going to dive right into part-time jobs or where to find them I'll compile that list of part-time jobs in my description box below so let's get started I want to highlight some of the most popular part-time work from home jobs the first category is data entry and the first company is Smart Crowd, which was formerly known as Virtual B. They have a starting pay rate at 30 cents for every thousand characters you type. Now, keep in mind with this company, once you apply, there is a waiting list. And there is a test that you must pass uh, before you are put on that um, waiting list and before you can start um, accepting data entry tasks. Now this site is only open to the US, so that is very important for those that are looking for data entry work. The next category is tutoring for those that love education and teaching and helping others. The first company is GoFluent. Now your role with Go, Go Fluent is to help students learn English. Now you must be able to work at least 20 hours per week, four hours per day. So um, you can work five days a week, four hours per day. This is another company that is open to multiple countries. The next company is iTutor Group, which um, also um, is owns um, Tutor ABC and other um, well-known tutoring companies. Now you are required to offer two sessions with this company for free so they can just get a feel of um, your tutoring skills to see if you are a great um, you know, candidate for the job and then you will start getting paid. Now you can um, conduct tutoring lessons on your own schedule. And the great thing about this company is they will accept teens that are 15 years of age or older. This is a co company that is also open to multiple countries. The next category is website testing. User testing is one of the really popular uh, website testing companies um, out today. You know, all of the other ones, I, you know, I would say that user testing is the, the one company that has the most consistency when it comes down to um, website testing work. Now, for those that are wondering what is website testing, it is where you go to a website and you may be asked to give your feedback about the appearance of that website, different ways that that um, website owner can improve their um, website. And you may require you to have either, you know, a webcam and a microphone because the person does want to, you know, be able to see you and, you know, hear your thoughts about the website. You must have a computer with a reliable internet connection and they will recruit in multiple countries so you are able to apply even if you are outside of the US. The user testing pays a flat rate of $10 per test via PayPal. The next company is Userlytics. This is another website testing company that involves carefully reviewing a client's website or a mobile app and you are asked to give your honest feedback you will earn $10 per every 
20 minute test. Once you complete these website tests, you are asked to, you know, fill out a little questionnaire, you know, providing your feedback. As well as this company does pay via PayPal. Multiple countries can sign up with this site, so I'll make sure I put all details in my description box below. The next category is chat job. For those that are wondering what a chat job is, um, you are basically um, communicating and providing customer service through a chat system. So you don't have to worry about being on the phone and, you know, taking phone calls. The first company that is widely known for, you know, um, hiring for chat agents is Needle. Um, your role involves, you know, providing that extra su support to online shoppers. So these are people that may be shopping on um, well-known uh, online sites like Skull Candy, Coach, Overstock, and other top brands. Now they will pay anywhere from ten to twelve dollars per hour, and this site is only open to the U.S. The next company is the Chat Shop. They also um, hire people to answer questions um, from potential customers all through a chat-based system. The starting pay rate is $10 per hour. They will provide training, and this is another company that is only open to the U.S. The next job you can do part-time is uh, a phone mystery shopping position. This work involves you um, calling up a random business and you are pretending to be a customer and you may be given some questions to ask that company. Um, and once you are complete with that call, you will need to, you know, fill out a questionnaire that, um, you know, shares all of the feedback and all of the, you know, information that you gather from that call. One of the popular companies that hire for that is call center QA. Um, you know, you will be able to um, use your cell phone. You can take mystery shop calls um, whenever um, you are free, uh, whenever they are, you know, available, because this is one of those companies that, you know, they don't always have a lot of uh, work available for you. You may be able to get, you know, maybe a few phone calls per week. Um, now they do pay $5 per every completed call. And, um, you know, it is only open, you know, to the U.S. So this is, you know, a very, you know, easy um, part time gig that you can pretty much do on the side in addition to another job. The next company is IntelliCheck. They also hire mystery shoppers. They also hire telephone mystery shoppers in the United States and Canada. Now, you should have at least. Um, six months of experience with, you know, telesales, data entry, or other administrative duties. Um, and you are required to work at least 10 hours per week. And most uh, telephone mystery shoppers, they earn around 9 to $14 per hour now. From my understanding, from doing a little research with, with IntelliCheck, you know, some of the work may involve you calling up maybe a tire shop and you may need to uh, be knowledgeable as far as, you know, different mechanical work. Um, so you can be able to ask questions about oil change and tune ups and different things like that. So that can kind of give you an idea of the type of work that you may be doing. The next category is transcription. Now, this is um, work that, you know, strictly involves, you know, maybe you're doing some typing. You may need a, a pair of headphones to be able to listen to audio, and then you'll type out the information that you hear. And even some companies may, re may require you to have a foot pedal, but these particular companies I'm, I'm going to share with you um, does not require, you know, an excessive amount of equipment. The first company is Transcribe Me. Uh, this is one of the, you know, most well-known companies that um, does accept beginners. They are really um, open to beginners that have absolutely no experience. But the one thing that they are very strict about is making sure that you can speak English fluently and be able to understand the English grammar. So if you are located outside of the U.S., you must have extensive knowledge of the um, English language, be able to understand and be able to, uh, you know, really understand and translate that um, into this company does. 
This company is open to multiple countries worldwide and they pay weekly via PayPal. The next company is Quick Take. Quick Take um, pays around, you know, 25 cents, one fourth cent per word for a general and legal transcription and a half a cent per word for medical transcription. Now, this is one of those companies that does require you to pay for a background check, which is $15. Now, if you are located outside of the U.S., you are uh, required to have a tax ID number and then you also must be able to pass a quiz before you are considered for a position. Babel Type is another company. This company offers competitive pay. You are able to work on your own schedule. You will earn $10 per every 15 minutes of audio you transcribe. So that is very important. You don't earn $10 per hour, but for every 15 minutes of straight audio that you transcribe. Now they do provide weekly payments via PayPal. And this is, this is one of those companies that um, does allow room for growth and being able to improve your typing skills. So you don't have to be an expert typer. They are willing to accept beginners. And Babel Type is open to multiple countries. The next part-time job is a virtual assistant. For those that are not uh, familiar with what a virtual assistant does, you know, you may be asked to do a, a variety of clerical tasks that include um, office work, administrative, uh, researching, typing, you know, it may require minimum phone work. And one of the popular companies that hire for that is Fancy Hands. Fancy Hands pays you to um, complete a variety of tasks. Um, you can work whenever you want. You can log out and log in whenever you want to complete a task. Now the pay is around $2.50 to $7 per task. Sorry, that is a typo there. It is not open worldwide. It is only open to the US. Customer service, you know, for those that are looking for some part-time work and companies that hire for customer service, which, you know, involves, you know, being on the phone, just providing um, straight customer service. These companies are willing to train you. The first company is Live Ops. They mostly hire for inbound customer service, so you don't have to worry about doing a lot of outbound work. Now, they hire bilingual agents, roadside assistants, agents, licensed insurance agents, um, and you are paid per minute as a customer service rep also schedules are flexible you can work in 30 minute increments and 30 minute blocks pretty much um, and it is only open to the u.s next is op um, this company hires for sales support and customer service agents now you are hired as an independent contractor and the starting pay rate is around 10 to 25 dollars per hour and they do have part-time schedules that are very flexible moderating is the next category where you are um, asked to maybe manage social media activities forums um, different um, you know activity that is going on online so this does require you to be pretty handy with the computer you know you must know your way around you know the computer and social media outlets one of the you know best companies that hire for that is mod squad you know they pay you to moderate forum forums and social media activity they pay anywhere from eight to $11 per hour and this is one of the few companies that are open to multiple countries job the last part-time job you guys could take on is a search evaluator position this position does require you also to be pretty handy with the computer as far as navigating through the internet and Google and Yahoo and different search engines now these companies may require you to complete a variety of activities whether it's on the internet on you know the so I mean the search engines or it could be the social media profiles App and Butler Hill is one of the you know few companies that hires social media evaluators to manage um, different social media channels, news, and also advertisements that you see online. The schedules are part time, twenty to twenty five hours per week, and they start off around thirteen dollars per hour. This is one of the few companies that also hire in multiple countries, so you can be able to apply even if you are outside of the U.S. 
Zero Childs also hires independent contractors as ad quality raters. They're not always hiring. So you have to be able to, you know, you have to check back regularly on their site to, you know, for any new positions that are listed. And they do start off around $13 per hour. So I really hope that you guys um, enjoyed this video. These are just a few companies that I wanted to highlight. If you check in my description box below, you will see a huge list of part-time work from home jobs that you can apply with. If you are looking for any more part-time work from home jobs, make sure you check out my official site, dreamhomebasework.com. I appreciate you guys for watching. Take care.